Hello fellow travelers, we're checking out wineries in Napa Valley, California, the wine capital of the United States. Welcome to another edition of Journey with Josh. Hello fellow travelers, if you don't know me, I'm Josh, and I'm a registered nurse that loves to travel. For the returning viewers, thank you very much. I really appreciate you coming back. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to the channel. It helps me with YouTube. Um, on this video, we're going to explore Stag's Leap Winery in Napa Valley. As you make your way up the Walnut Tree Line Drive, you see acres of wine producing vineyards stretched out as far as the eyes can see. And if you look close enough, you can see itty bitty wine bottles starting to grow on the vines. Now, we arrived a little bit early, so I took the opportunity to walk around a bit and enjoy the scenery. We chose this winery because it has an interesting story. The vineyard has a long storied history dating back to 1872 when the first grapes were planted. The estate changed hands multiple times over the years and went into disarray. But in seven, 1970, Carl Dumani purchased the property and restored it, which took nine years. During this time, he restored the vineyards and resumed winemaking under the Stag's Leap label. In 1996, Behringer, now Treasury Wine Estates, Purchase the property. Stag Sleep is most notably known for their Cabernet Sauvignons and their Chardonnays. So let's get some wine tasting and start this show. The tasting was conducted on the veranda of the Old Chase home. It was a beautiful, intimate setting. Inside the home, you'll find an eclectic chandelier made from antlers. A quick peek at the enormous fireplace that grounds the living room gives you an idea of the craftsmanship that took place in building this beautiful home. My, would I like to get my hands on those bottles. Yum! Stained glass windows on the inside overlook beautiful gardens on the outside. As we sat down for the tasting, our glasses were already placed and ready for us. Soledad then began her amazing tale of the vineyard's storied history as the wines began to pour. Soledad explained the wines as we progressed from the whites to the rosés to reds. Hi guys, we are having the most amazing time here at Stag's Leap. They have some of the best wines that I've had so far. Uh, their Cabernet and their Syrah is just delicious their rosé and their Cabernet Sauvignon. This is heaven. I mean, this is heaven. You must stop by here. You get a personalized service. So that is wonderful. Again, the grounds are gorgeous. So yeah, this is wonderful. Really having a great time. Okay guys, we have just finished our tasting at Stag's Leap. Stag's with an apostrophe after the S. Make sure you know that because that makes a big difference. What did we like about this? 
so everything yeah this place we did some research before picking the places that we went and this is one of the ones that we had to choose between a couple and we made the right choice this this was essentially a personalized tasting and tour where we had our own person soledad who was great uh, she was amazing so amazing if you if you come here ask for soledad if you can yeah the wines were incredible they had a great selection reds whites rosé uh, it's just really good wine um, the wine variety was amazing we actually purchased wine and we didn't think that we were going to do that uh, we're going to have it sent to us um, mailed to us at home really really love the grounds the gardens here are beautiful you actually can walk around the gardens and um, the, the house is beautiful you can you can explore the house so that's kind of one of the, the great things about this wine tasting is that you can actually do things um, around the grounds and, and explore and learn about the history of this. Uh, Soledad told us about the history of the winery even more than I mentioned. Um, it was wonderful. Um, unfortunately, we have to go because we have another winery that we have to visit. But uh, I would, I, this right here was very special. And I want to thank everybody at the Stag Sleep Winery for treating us so well, for being so nice and so knowledgeable. Uh, really, stop by here if you can. Okay? Anything else? That's it. On okay. to the next. Okay, guys, on to the next winery. Well, that's all for this edition. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel to find out where we head to next in Napa Valley. And don't forget to click on that notification bell to be updated whenever I upload another video. As always, thanks for tripping with me.